I'll give you a few seconds to think of some of the best academies or teams that you believe produce or have produced the most young talents. Whatever team or academy you thought about, you're probably right. Because you've seen those academies, produce those players and you've watched them become great. But I want to introduce you to a very, very underrated team. Which has produced World Cup winners, Premier League winners, Spanish champions and just great overall talents. With the risk of absolutely destroying the name with my pronunciation, I present to you... Le <laughs> Alright, now I'm sorry for that pronunciation to my French fans, but let's get into this. Product number one, Paul Pogba. Before joining United as a young boy, Pogba was a standout talent of Le Havre. He then joined Manchester United's youth system and left for free in the summer of 2012 to Juve, as you well know. After that, it was <laughs> smooth sailing for Pogba. 2013 he became a world champion with France under 20 and then he was also announced as the golden boy and then of course he was player of the year in the Serie A, won four titles there, two cups, two super cups, came to United, won the Europa League, the League Cup and of course the young boy from Le Havre became a world champion. Product number two, Riyad Mahrez. He moved to Le Havre at a very, very fragile age and actually Mahrez didn't put up crazy numbers for a team that was in the second division and in France and for what he became as a player, you would expect some crazy numbers. But Leicester still saw promise in him, bought him for just under half a million pounds and then of course, to keep this short for you guys, the rest is history. He won everything you can win in England and in 2019 saw glory with his country, just like Pogba. Algeria won the African Cup of Nations. Product number 3 Dimitri Payet Since leaving the youth system of Le Havre and becoming a pro in France, Payet unfortunately hasn't been very successful at getting silverware. But us Premier League fans will always remember his magic at West Ham, for sure. You can't forget that. Now to be fair to him, he did get to the Euros final and also to the Europa League final so who knows, maybe third time lucky. But Listen, he's been a marvellous player in the Premier League and he still continues to be a good player in France. So, another great product. Product number 4, Ferland Mendy. This guy, to me perhaps, has one of the most impressive journeys to the top. Mendy only started playing football around the age of 16 and he joined Le Havre. Since then, it's been crazy for him, right? Listen to this. After only four seasons at Le Havre, he moved to Lyon. And after only two seasons there, he moved to Real Madrid, <laughs> where he already won the league. I mean, this is a crazy, crazy journey, bro. I don't even know how he developed so fast, but he's at the very top now. An impressive journey, to say the least. Product number five, and the second Mendy on this list, Benjamin Mendy. The last guy on this list is another serial winner. He started at Le Havre and also turned pro at Le Havre. Benjamin Mendy joined Marseille and then was quickly snapped out by Monaco where he was part of that insane team which I think we all remember which won the league in France when they went against that incredible PSG side as well and also got to the Champions League semi-finals after knocking out Manchester City. Since then he did join Manchester City and won everything you could win just like Riyad Mahrez and then also became the second world champion on this list. Now, I wanted to keep this short because you guys know everything about these players, right? They're in, uh, they're in the spotlight every single week for us. But listen, their journey to the top started at this team. And, and all these players have one single factor in common, right? Which is success. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was your boy G Alex. See you in the next one. I'm out. Thank you.